So what's the fun of a 3D printed helicopter without 3D printed blades? And there you have it. 200 millimeter standard blades for this Goose Guy S2 that I've designed and 3D printed. But before I get into it, let's do a quick test flight and see how they fly. How do you really feel? <laughs> Are you happy? Yeah, it's I'm super happy. That's insane. I mean, they're, they're very flexible. I guess. But I mean, hey, they worked. And that's all that matters. A fully 3D printed Goose Guy S2. Who would have thought? Thing is, if you fly hard enough, you'll hit the boom. These, these are blades for like beginners. They just want to fly around, flip a little bit. Perfect for beginners. All right, so it flew well. I'm not gonna lie, I probably shouldn't have been standing next to this helicopter as close as I did. It was a short video and a short flight because I didn't know what the capabilities of these 200 millimeter 3D printed blades were. I will do a lot more test flights. And as I had mentioned, yes, these are very flexible blades. So for sport flying, hovering, simple inverted maneuvers, perfect for that. But I will try to 3D these blades a little harder than I did in the video. But there you have it, it is possible. I just did a basic profile of a helicopter blade. You do not need the spacers that you usually have to put into these blade grips. But besides that, it works. I'm pretty happy with the result. And if you guys like this video, please like and subscribe. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching.